welcome back to another vlog so in this video guys i'm going to be taking you guys through my preparation for my birthday shoot slash the barbie movie premiere happening here in lagos nigeria but first off let us start with this package that just arrived i've been looking for you know like really good hair that i can you know wear for my shoots i was trying to like buy some hair pieces this year i haven't really shopped for hair this year Sha, but i found this brand i i saw someone that was talking about this hair brand and i decided to invest in this hair i got like four wigs I know, I know, I know. Don't look at me like that. I've been saving up to buy these wigs, guys. So I ordered like four wigs and I am up for trying out new things. I wanted to try colored hair. If you know me, you know that I wear a lot of black hair. I decided to be more versatile with the color of hair that I'm buying this period. So I ordered four different wigs and they just arrived and I'm showing you guys. So this is the wavy hair this is a 22 inches 4x4 four four closure i like the color guys look at the color so rich i haven't decided yet on the one i'm going to wear for my birthday shoots but i'm wearing a white dress for my shoots i've always wanted to try you know burgundy and uh, this is a burgundy frontal 12 inches yes <sighs> come to mama i actually cannot wait to try it Oh, maybe I should just try it now. To prevent breakage, I always like to have my hair moisturized before I wear my wigs. Now, where is my wig cap? I need to get my wig cap. The name of the brand, Raw Hair Boutique. Yeah, they're quite affordable because the prices of hair these days is ridiculous. Like, you go on Instagram and you're seeing, you know, you're seeing certain hair vendors and you see their prices and you're like, whoa. It looks nice by the time i style it it should come out really nice but yeah maybe i'll wear this one for my shoot nice guys what do you think maybe i would use this one or the black one i'm actually feeling this one this one's giving guys i also polished my nail pink since we have uh the barbie premiere coming up i decided to do pink the color of my outfits for the premiere i'm either gonna wear a sparkly dress like a silver sparkly dress or a black dress say hi to my camera say hi hi all right okay so um yeah i'll carry you guys through the preparation tomorrow tomorrow i should do my hair get everything i need for my shoot ready tomorrow i have to go attend to these kids and um, prep for better hello guys so um it's the next day i am headed now to the salon but i'll make a quick stop at grand cobbler i have a sandals that's out for repair so i'll pick it up from the grand cobbler first also i think i will do a quick stop at the lady that um wax my body i need to wax my armpits tomorrow is my photo shoot i am prepping for my shoot already everything that i need is ready and set by the time i get back home i would bring out everything and just put them together and accessorize i'm heading out i had to cover my hair i do not want to wear a wig i do not want to put anything on my hair so i have this gorgeous um head wrap from flaunt archive on instagram i absolutely love this headband if you ever run into me during school runs or run into the supermarket i usually will have this on my head i have it in several colors you know it's just convenient like i don't have to stress or worry about my hair it's it's actually like a lifesaver for me like no bad headache for me i always have this with me so it takes care of of that so let's go now let's step out and um i have to <laughs> dodge from my son we are at that phase where he cries when i'm leaving the house i was about leaving my house and i ran into my sister she had just made like seafood banga soup seafood banga soup with a lot of prawns and snail eating with i run out can you imagine i'm running late but food is life <laughs> i'm here now at my waxing parlor <laughs> uh, i just wanted to wax my underarms because of my shoots tomorrow now i'll come back maybe on saturday to wax the remaining part of my body i have 
guys i have had the worst day i can't even describe how i feel right now like i can't even describe the feelings the disappointment the betrayal because yes i'm going to use the word betrayal because i feel really let down at the moment my photographer that i've used for a couple of years now made plans with him i don't know why he would think i i would be bluffing with such kind of events coming up i don't know why he thought that i was shooting on a certain day and you know the makeup artist did not think that way the makeup artist knew that we were shooting on the set date and he's telling me that he thought we were shooting next week guys this guy has disappointed me he's not available for us to shoot tomorrow i was at the salon by the way my hair I, I couldn't even do my hair because the wig i needed to shoot with didn't come on time it came late yesterday and i couldn't send it into the salon and when i took it to the salon today they needed to customize it and i think bleach the knots and do all those things i was called and pluck the frontal as well so i couldn't just even stay there i was so angry i had to call my friend to suggest a different photographer and find he is available for us to shoot tomorrow luckily enough he was available for us to shoot at 3 p.m tomorrow i had to move it to 3 p.m guys my tomorrow was meant to be so smooth i was meant to start my day start my shoot and everything early so that by evening i will not be too tired when it's time for the barbie premiere but with the way things are going i i don't know how tomorrow is going to look like so that means i will try my possible best to go to bed really early today so that i wake up really oh my god they just took the lights okay guys i'm so frustrated and nepa is also taking the piece today like why did they take the lights when i was talking when i was ranting anyways i had to get a new photographer who's available luckily enough he's available for me to shoot uh, at 3 p.m tomorrow i have to wake up very early work out attend to the kids run straight to the salon tomorrow morning to style and install my hair and then run back home really quickly to get my makeup done before before three o'clock which is the time i told the photographer that we're going to shoot tomorrow i really do not know what to say like i was so angry i even told him not to call me anymore that's how angry i was to be honest like i have had this doubt of you know doing any photo shoots for my birthday this year for some reason i was just unbothered about doing a shoot and i think it was when we got into the month of july the ginger eventually came to so think that things are going this way now i'm like so pissed i'm too stressed i have a headache this day would have ended in a much better note but in every disappointment they say you have to thank god there's the barbie premiere tomorrow i don't even feel like going anymore that's how disconnected from reality that's how unbothered about everything happening around me that's how i feel right now super unbothered like i don't even want to do anything anymore i i don't like when things don't go the way i envisioned it and it really stresses me out like now i currently have a headache because i was thinking of what to do next i was even cancelling and my sister was like nope you cannot cancel look for an alternative oh god i, I think i've come too far to even quit that's the word ah uh, god take control take control lord jesus anyways i'll pick up my camera tomorrow and then we'll talk hi guys it's the next day who do i have here can we see what you're reading the book series. a book series called anisha the accidental detective and this is like the third book from the collection it was a collection of five books yeah so that's what emma has been reading so since the holiday yeah. started so Okay, so guys the lights went off and, oh. as usual anyways i am just about to leave the house it's past nine i should be leaving the house soon to the salon so i can install my wig and then i will meet up with my makeup artist and then we'll come back home and start like i mentioned yesterday i was able to get another photographer who's going to come by 3 p.m he's also very busy so i have to make sure my 3 p.m is 3 p.m today so yeah we've concluded on what um what style i'm going for what look i'm going for and he's going to source out everything that we need to make this shoot work 
also my brother will be um getting some visuals as well hopefully i'll be excited about attending the movie premiere later on today guys we're heading home this hair was like it took like two hours because i got here a few minutes past 10 so it's past uh, 12 now all right okay guys i'm about to start my makeup dd signature is doing my face beats today let's do this now is um, 10 minutes past 2 I think we're on track yeah we are on track hi guys so I am just about to go down now for my shoot the photographer just arrived I think I am on track thank god that i don't have to keep him waiting so he's the one now that has to set up and i'm the one waiting so that was the whole plan but anyway i think i look absolutely amazing but we have to make the makeup more intense so that i can show you my pictures and my pink nails look amazing as well yeah but guys rate my look as usual this hair even looked better than i anticipated you know thank god i chose to go for white sorry i had to make you flip your screen but I think I look like a goddess, even my husband even complimented me now. You know, you have ideas in your head, but you don't know how it will pan out in the end, but I think it's looking good. Meanwhile, this is what I have for Barbie, this sparkly dress. That's what I intend to wear for Barbie. I do not want to wear pink because I know everybody will be wearing pink. The theme is glam Barbie, so we're going glam, okay? I'm going all dolled up, all spackled up for Barbie tonight. Stay tuned guys, stay tuned. Okay, let's go downstairs. So I'm pairing this look with another sparkly sandal from Renee Calvilla. guys so i am done um shooting downstairs done with my birthday shoot and also done with the video and pictures i was taking for this particular outfit guys i think i look absolutely amazing guys absolutely amazing <laughs> so this was the outfit i bought for my birthday last year um it was how will i put it now i needed to lose weight basically i didn't like how i looked in the dress so and also yeah last year i did not go clubbing like i thought i would so i ended up getting another dress for my birthday entirely my phone is ringing and i need to go answer it it could be my friend that i am attending the barbie premiere with okay it's a number number has been calling me since it's like four missed calls I love this cute butterfly ring. It's one of my recent purchases. Hello? So guys, I'm finally headed to the Barbie movie premiere at 2 8. I can't believe I am late. But yeah, the few friends I've called are also not there at the moment. So I think I'm okay. I don't think I wanted to attend the the red carpet so i'm sure they're wrapping up with the red carpet now it's nigeria i'm sure they didn't see this that time but yeah let's do this makeup is still popping it's still giving did you see nature kill this Hi guys, welcome back. So I'm back home. Barbie movie was fun. I loved the storyline about the movie and all the ideology or rather all the ideas that we have 
of Barbie. I think they tried to demystify it in this movie. It was interesting. I liked the the script. I loved everything about it. It was very colorful. It was fun. A lot to learn from the Barbie movie. You guys need to watch this movie to understand what I'm saying. There was a lot of comedy in the movie. I didn't expect to have this amount of fun watching it. Like it was good. As expected, the pink carpet was pink. Literally almost everybody wore pink. So thank God I did not wear pink. So yeah, <laughs> I needed to say that. It was pink. Like I've never seen that amount of people gather wearing pink in my life ever. People came out, people brought their A game. The fashion was off the roof. It was fun. I had a good time with my dates. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this um, vlog. I actually enjoyed filming it as well. And it's time to take off this makeup and switch back to the Ifama that you know because this Ifama is about to go away. This hair was given, it stayed curled all through the day, like it keeps curls. It's part of the hair that I ordered from Arthur's Boutique. It's so good, guys. Very affordable, too. So, you should check them out as well. I'll link their Instagram handle here as well. In the meantime, stay safe. Thank you guys for watching my vlog. I will see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you soon in my next video. Let me go clean up and go to bed, guys. It's past 12 midnight. Yes, past 12 midnight. Bye, guys.